how much trash talking is there uh, between USC alum and Stanford alum and Pac-12 alum in the locker room? Is it all the time? All the time. The big thing is uh, the whole everyone every uh, every weekend. Guys are always making friendly bets with each other. And uh, one of my best friends plays for USC. Great friend of mine, and we've been kind of you know texting and calling all week. And you know we're trying to put a friendly wager on it. And um, last year Stanford beat USC. So I made him, he had to wear a Stanford t-shirt all week in the oh. locker room. I do have a picture of it. Uh, so it was kind of a, and it's a would, fun thing. You would have had to wear an SC t-shirt? Yeah, yeah. It would have been embarrassing if I had now, to wear an SC one. What's the bet this year? I can't say. All right. How would you describe yourself as a person? Oh. <laughs> I'll tell you, you have a hard worker. What kind of cliche is that? <laughs> That's why I was probably trying to like suck up to some alumni to get a job or something. I don't know. That's what was your favorite class at Stanford? I took a golf class. That was that was fun. I took a golf class. So it's true. Even at Stanford, the football players take the easy classes. Is this true? <laughs> we, we have to take real classes, but I took a golf class. I liked it. No, there were a lot of good classes. Yeah. Probably what did I pick? What did I say? You said anything I got an A in. <laughs> and your least not favorite many, not too many your least favorite class was <laughs> any class I got a C in so there are more yeah. of those yeah that's, that's, <laughs> all right who's your favorite Stanford player of all time I like I like a lot of them John Lynch I remember playing against John Lynch did he take it easy on you uh you know would he I don't, uh, uh, is there like a little handshake between Stanford alum you know I don't, I don't think so I don't think so we lost by like 30 points Give me a breakdown of how Stanford beats USC today. Well, I, you know, I think Stanford's got a great defense, obviously. So I think they got to, you know, you want to keep, you know, keep them from not being explosive. I think SC thrives on being explosive plays and kind of getting ahead and controlling the game. And I think Stanford's got to do what, you know, Stanford does and kind of control the tempo of the game. You know, have put put together long drives and don't let those don't don't let the offense have those big plays. And uh, at the end of the day, I think we're the most we're the more physical team and kind of impose our will onto USC.